Oh, dude, I passed by a giant crab yesterday. <laughs> it was it was a king crab in a window. Oh fuck and yeah! It, it this was in this was in Newcastle. It was a giant wow. king crab in a window, Newcastle. And all I could think was just running up to it and striking through the glass through its head with a sword. That's that's all that was on my mind. Yeah, but that would be a quick death. <sighs> yeah, you're right. That's not good enough. No, I, I was going to strike the sword and just get its left legs. I and think throw him out in the street and chase him. Do that, right? But then you pin it to the ground. <laughs> so, and then you take the other half and you tie yeah. those legs to your like moped. Yeah. yeah. Right. Each one of the <laughs> each one of the Deliveroo bikes. Yeah. All exactly. right, boys. Yeah. Let it rip. Is that a what is this whole joke? Deliveroo. Um Oh, that's just their uh, Uber Eats. Uber Eats, okay. Um, I'm so I'm so English now, man. We talked about fish and chips last time. Yeah, man. We went out for dinner on Thursday, <laughs> and I saw, you know, I was like, I saw fish tacos on the menu. I was like, that's pretty much as close as you can get. Yeah. And if I get fries separate, you know, pretty much be the uh, same. Ah. Uh. So I got it, and I'm like, are these good? He's like, oh, yeah, Dan. I just had them for lunch this morning or today. I highly recommend them. I'm like, great. Fuck yeah. Breaded, please. Make sure these fuckers are fried. Yeah. And it just was not the same. Not even. No. No. You're thinking about her. Everything reminds me of her. Everything. Yeah. More UK tings. I just remembered something. Uh, I actually meant to say this when I was in Birmingham. The gritty is worldwide. <laughs> Okay. And and when I say that, what I mean is um I'm literally doing the gritty white right now. Okay. That statement is worldwide. Really? Dude, walking into a Tesco, I'm standing outside of Tesco, and it was like, I don't know, three women. They're they're walking around, they're like a bottle of vodka, so they're at least, you know, twelve. Okay. And <laughs> now they were, you know, I would imagine they are like college or on the cusp of. Okay. And they're in full English accents, you know, Midlands English accent. And then they they break character and in perfect American English. I'm literally doing a goody right now. <laughs> like, do they say it to you? Uh, No, they're just saying it to each that, other, that to like each other. joking around. Yeah. Wow. And then I was watching some because... You know, now my phone my phone's been listening to me, so I get pushed like uh, like Ireland subreddits and you know UK TikToks. And I was watching some video, and yeah, the like the the people in the video were were just somewhere, you know, not America. And same thing, broke character. So I'm literally doing a goody right now. Really? Yeah. So they don't even say it in a British accent. No. Literally doing the gritty right now. No, no. Wow. Oh, mate, I'm literally doing the gritty right now. <laughs> I don't know where that would be. That might no. I don't know the new. That was dude. Liam. Wherever Liam was from. Yeah, no, that's that's Adam. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're right. Look up Adam Love Island birthplace. Oh, mate, I'm literally doing the gritty right now. <laughs> that might be Newcastle-ish, dude. The way they say literally is so so unique. Literally. Literally. It's from Newcastle. Yeah. Literally. What the fuck is Adam Pollard doing now? Oh, it turns out he's My still f- hot. <laughs> he's blonde now. Oh, nice. Yeah, Scouse is the is the tough one. You know. Well, I was fucking walking my dog and then you just don't fucking take a shit in your front yard. <laughs> <laughs> um, Sorry. On his... Uh... He just he just got lost yeah, in his he sorry. Got lost in his chest. He must have had the Johnson and Johnson vaccine like a thousand times. Because that one makes you sexy, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's, that's why they took it off the market. By the way, guys, we posted another Cody and Noel do chaotic. Well, I guess this comes out next week, so you would know probably you would have seen it. But yeah, it yeah. Well, let's reflect on our time with Salt Hank and Owen. We can finally talk about it together. Did we talk about our time with Hank? No, not really. We, I mean, we we alluded to it. I think we joked. We were laughing about how we made him super racist. <laughs> yeah, so we 
we joke about that, right? Like one of the running bits is that like at the beginning he said something about Owen's eyes or something, and then you were like, "Whoa, don't talk about Asians like that" or something. And I'm like, "That's a little yeah. right." And he was like stressing so hard about it. <laughs> and then he's you know he's roommates with Connor, so he went home, and then yeah. I saw Connor like later that day or the next day or something. He was like, "Dude, Hank was a fucking mess." When I got home, he was just sitting at the living room table drinking a beer by himself. <laughs> you want beer? Like I, I need. I had to. Like I'm so stressed. About what just happened? And I was like, wait, what? he was that fucked up about it? And he was like, yeah, man. Like you guys messed him up. And I was like, we didn't meet. It was all in good fun. Like, oh, dude, it was too good. Saul Hank, what a trooper! What a trooper, man. Noel stops between jokes like he's waiting for the audience to laugh. Yes. Yes. I've been doing this. My entire Wait, existence. The way Hank is panicking the whole time, trying to entertain the drunk children. Next episode, they have two teams, uh, Owen and Noel and Hank and Cody. Um, their cook-off would be nuts. Now, why did they spell Cody with a cake? <laughs> so anyways, people are loving it, guys. Yeah, they're loving it. So yeah, give it a watch if you haven't already. No, it was a good time. Shout out Hank. It was man. a good time. Uh, we got to do more of those, honestly. We got to build a little kitchen and just do them all the time. Click the car- the crab one. Yeah, why don't we close it out on fighting a crab for a carrot? Oh, oh my god. I don't think we can show that. <laughs> why why not? I don't know, isn't that <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what the I, rule on animal not, violence is. That's the humane way to kill a crab. <laughs> oh, just to do, you know the comments, man. Why are comments, they're so obvious, but they're so funny. Does this hurt the crab? <laughs> he made him a puzzle. Like, god damn it. Hilarious. Bro really said, parry this. <laughs> 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 Little bro got divided. <laughs> <laughs> that Yo, that that is the difference between Gen Z and us. That's how they set up their punchlines. They just put little bro in, fr- in front of it. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And it's funny. Like, it makes it funnier. Nah. See, but also the editing is insane. Yo, I'm about to hire this kid. Uh, isn't he good? I'm about to Go hire this kid. I want to see the way he's walking in the beginning. <laughs> Dude, that Yo, walk is so funny. Whittily doing the gwitty. 